wondering, how can I learn how to play the guitar? Or, I wish I could play melodious tunes to move someone. Well, tonight, I, David Watlington, will try to tell you. Before we think about how we should approach this, we're going to have to take a step back, six years back, to 2008. When you first pick up a guitar, and you're going to play the first song that anybody learns on the guitar whenever they learn how to play the guitar. <laughs> Smoke on the water, followed closely by Nine notes will carry you through the next two months of practice. <laughs> but you got those down. Now it's time to move on to something a little bit trickier, a little bit crazier. you a good eight weeks to learn. It's almost 2008 by now, and you're ready to put the guitar down. You've been playing like three days a week. Your fingers are getting sore. It's time to pick up some video games. And what logical video game to explore the new music you've found than Guitar Hero? You've moved on from simple power chords or the first and fifth notes of every scale, such as Rocky Like a Hurricane, artistically intricate pieces, if you will, such as My Name is Jonas. It's not as powerful sounding because you're not using power chords, but it's still pleasant. And you think, I, I wonder, are there more songs that use more fingers to play, that, where you pick the strings with your fingers. If there were a style, I don't know, finger picking, that, that would be great. So you, 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 learn, you search online and you find the, the behemoth, the entryway rather, not behemoth, and classical guess, this, this stepping stone into the world of finger style guitar playing, where you're using more than simply your thumb to pick the guitar.
takes you a year. Playing every day for at least an hour. Maybe a month to get the intro, three months for the first verse. But slowly, steadily, you work on it day after day, and you're excited by it, and every day you can hear yourself getting better and better, and it becomes almost easy for you after a while. It's 2012 now. You're in high school, you're ready to move on to something harder again. So, you explore to YouTube, and you find a Korean boy who's your age. He was born only two weeks after you, named Sun Ha Jung, and he plays exactly what you want to hear. He plays fingerstyle guitar like he was born with a guitar in his hands. And he he takes pop songs and reworks them for fingerstyle guitar, like Fireflies. his own music. Yeah, he writes his own music. He's, he's found a way to discover the rhythms and melodies that he has inside of himself. And I'll show you an example. He wrote a song called Gravity, which I particularly like.
himself, you think, wow, I wonder if I can do that. So you stop, and you dissect it, you break it down into its pieces, and you, you discover that it was heavily influenced by another song, Ebon Coast. Explore, you explore all the other music that's influenced you on your journey to becoming where you are. You think back to the Iron Man, Smoke on the Water, classical gas, gravity, the structures, the, the techniques used in each piece, and you, you finger pick your favorites, no pun intended, and you come up with Odi et Amor, which is Latin for I Hate and I Love. Yes.